everyone, it's Ben here from Triple Jump. You may notice I'm alone on this sofa and that's because Peter's away today. But I couldn't wait any longer to just make something a little bit different than usual. So if you're plugged in at all to the ever-expanding universe and lore of Untitled Goose Game, you may have seen on Twitter that somebody called Sam Person has created a little uh, Windows plugin that lets you have a desktop goose that stamps around your screen and runs away with the mouse cursor and leaves muddy footprints and all sorts of other things. And I thought, well, what better use for that than by combining it with actual Untitled Goose Game? So that's what I'm going to attempt today. Right, so I've got the game up. As you can see, I have downloaded the uh, goosedesktop.exe from, from Sam's website, link is in the description. And we're just going to launch this uh, launch this goose. I'll put my headphones on so I can actually hear it. And then just attempt to play this game and, and see how we get on. Now I'm not particularly proficient with mouse and keyboard. I usually use a, uh, a controller. However, it seems that the mouse cursor is something that the goose finds irresistible. So it's it's important to to include it. Are we ready? Let's um, let's get him on. That. There he is. So it's sort of like those um, desktop buddies you could get for XP and earlier Windows operating systems that would be a bit of a... They would just be sort of a desktop companion and then sometimes you could download these custom viruses that people made uh, that, you know, weren't really viruses. Oh. And now he's tracking mud onto the screen. So that's good. Right, let's attempt to... Let's just... Should we just get started? Let's see what happens. And there's my last save. Yes! This is it. Okay, good. I'm liking this so far. It's quite clear that they've... They've imported sound effects for the desktop goose from actual Untitled Goose Game. Doesn't seem that fussed so far. Oh, I think that was Desktop Goose. Desktop Goose slowly making its way off screen. And that's fine. Let's right click. Oh Christ, what is this? <laughs> Good. So it's now brought a meme onto the screen. Grab that. Perfect. Did it. First time. Outstanding. That meme is still there. I can close it, but I kind of want to just leave. Oh, what's he bringing on now? <laughs> For God's sake. It's a very nice meme. Thank you. Off he goes. Or she. Don't know. Don't know what the gender of that goose is. If it's a goose, it's probably a woman. That's what Twitter taught me. But we're going together. This is great. Oh my God. It's so loud. It's so much louder than the game is. Come on, farmer. This is, the, this is the real challenge here. Oh, no, I clicked off the game because of the meme that's in the way. Oh, he's bringing another one. What's this? Good work. It's just a little slapping feet. I can't work out which one is me and which one is desktop goose. <laughs> oh, honks! Thanks, bud. Oh, Jesus Christ. I don't know how I got the keys off him last time. Funny impossible now. Thank you. Thank you, desktop goose. Really appreciate it. It's not gonna be long before I can't see much more of this screen. What are you gonna do? Oh, God. Please, don't go in the top right of the screen. I can't see anymore. I want his keys. Let me have the keys. Oh, what is that now? It's supporting the the artist who made this fine, fine, fine piece of software. Now he's just tracking mud all over his own gifts. Please. Oh God, oh God, he see me. I don't know where I am. I don't even know where I am. Please, Desktop Goose, just be merciful. 
Oh, no, I've right clicked on a meme because that's all I can see. That's just the set. You've already given me that one. <laughs> I can't. I can't do anything. Here's a new one. What is that? It's very hard to type with feet. Okay, very good. He's yet to steal the mouse cursor. That's something he hasn't done. He's off. Look at him. Look at him go. There's just so, there's such little screen left. Where's the hit button? How do I hit, how do I hit the child? Oh, I clicked on a bloody meme again. Come on. Oh, this is a new one. What's this fun one? I am an agent of chaos. I can't argue with that. That's it, it's my phone booth now. Tell you what we'll do. We're gonna leave this for 10 minutes. Don't know what he's honking at now. We'll leave this for 10 minutes and we'll come back and we'll see, we'll see what the screen looks like. This is stupid. This is so ridiculous. Oh, oh God, sorry. Um, oh, great, another one, just bring it in. I'm an agent of chaos, I know, I know you are. So this is, this is what it looks like after about 10 minutes. I've yet to have desktop goose run away with my mouse cursor. Um, which is probably a blessing really, but he has brought me an awful lot of poorly, poorly worded notepads and uh, and a lot of memes, which you know isn't isn't necessarily a bad thing, but it's also not not a very helpful thing either. It does add it does add something to the Untitled Goose Game experience. I will say that much. There's um, sort of sort of gives it an air of authenticity that while you are annoying people within the within the village in Untitled Goose Game, you're also being sort of terrorized by by a goose yourself. Um, so in my professional opinion, this is the definitive way to play Untitled Goose Game. And uh, oh god off he goes. Look at the speed. Okay, right, we're back at the well. We've been up here yet? I can't, I just can't see. No, we haven't been. If I can get into the pub while playing with such a disadvantage, then I think I'll have done quite well, to be honest. Oh, oh, I nearly did it then. And we've got another meme incoming. I've got two screens and I can see the goose is slowly dragging it in. Oh, look, a box, another box to take in. Fantastic, come on. That's it. The perfect crowd, what's this? I cause problems on purpose. I know you've told me that one. I've seen that one before. I know you're very proud of it though. Proud of all of your memes. You want a show? I'll give you a show. Big fans. Can't click almost anywhere on the screen now. It's their world. It's decreasingly becoming my world because I simply can't see it. I'm going, I'm going. I'm going, I'm getting out of there for God's sake. Hello? Right, that's it, I can't do any more of this. There we go. That is what it looks like to attempt to play Untitled Goose Game with the desktop goose ex executable file installed. I don't really know what it is. It's uh thank you. Thank you so much. As I said at the beginning of the video, a link to download this desktop goose will be in the description. If you want to just be generally annoyed in your day-to-day -day life. However, this is this is peak untitled goose game. So any aficionados of, of waterfowl and waterfowl based games should probably consider playing it with this installed.
I hope this video has been educational. We do love to learn here at Triple Jump. And if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, why not consider, you know, why not consider doing... Oh, he's bringing another one. Why not consider doing that? What does this one say? Ah, it's just, it's just some symbols. Thank you. If you've used Desktop Goose, why not tell us all about your experiences in the comments below? And please do support the creator of this app uh, because, you know, I mean, look at it. It's clearly magical. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye.